All right, so Jugmeet Singh's uh, going after these big, greedy CEOs once again. This time, it's after it's about uh, climate change. So let's just see what he has to say, because when I watched this video, it sounded a lot to me like he was just kind of pandering to Justin Trudeau's ideas. So let's have a look, and then we'll talk about it after, like usual. You're denying that fossil fuels being burned has anything to do with climate change. Is that, is that what you're suggesting? I'm, I'm suggesting to you that I don't know, and I'm... Suggesting to you that uh, very few people know. About it. So uh, it's clear that you're you're denying the impact of, of the climate crisis and the fact that that burning fossil fuel contributes to that. That's deeply troubling. Um, um, so do you think your industry shares responsibility in what's going on? That's the question. Yeah, I think what it does, Mister Singh, is it highlights the complexity of the issue. I'm not a forester, and I know nothing about hurricanes. I don't know if CO2 caused these fires. I don't know if CO2 caused Okay, fires. so you're denying that fossil fuels being burned. In typical NDP style, the video, of course, was really annoying. The audio was too low on the voices, but then they have this stupid loud beep. Just, again, mess of a video. The guy said he didn't know, and Jugmeet Singh kept saying, well, so you're denying? No, he said he didn't know, stupid. But again... Just taking another page out of Justin Trudeau's book. I thought you guys uh, had your little breakup. What, what's going on here? And I understand that this is an issue, but let's just say that Jugmeet Singh is right here. Let's just say that the CO2 caused by all these carbon emissions is what's causing all these fires and these hurricanes, which, again, is very debatable. Let's just say that's true. Well, what's his plan? What's Jugmeet Singh's plan going to be? Here's his plan. He's going to tax people like these greedy, rich CEOs, which, again, some of them are. There are immoral capitalists out there. We do need to do something about that. But this guy wants to change capitalism basically into socialism. And he wants to do that by taxing people at 80% after they make a certain amount of money. Well, the problem with doing that is, let's think about it this way. If you're a rich person, right, or if you're striving to be a rich person, why do you want that? You want that so that you have freedom and that your life is a lot easier. And this asshole wants to make their lives harder by taxing the crap out of them, which means what are they going to do? Well, they're already rich, which means they already have the freedom. They're going to leave. And then we're going to get stuck with all the tax bills that he's going to want to pass. And then we won't have it. And then what happens? Well, now you have Jugmeet Singh who would run out of other people's money. I believe that's happened to a few other countries in the past before who liked communism or socialism. And it destroys the country. This guy has no plan to fix anything. It's just tax, 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 tax. And this is the excuse that they're using to tax people. Justin Trudeau is doing the same thing right now with the carbon tax. But I'll be honest with you. I think that if Jugmeet Singh was ever the Prime Minister of Canada, he would actually somehow, some way, be even worse than Justin Trudeau. Because he wants to tax us even more than Justin Trudeau does. What a capital gains tax would look like under Jugmeet Singh, it wouldn't be a, like a small percentage of after 250. It would be a massive percentage. Like 80%. I've heard him say it. This guy's not coming to save you. He's coming after your money. And while he's blowing our money on you know foreign wars or whatever the hell, he's going to be walking around wearing another gold Rolex watch and another Gucci bag, walking into another stretch limo. And that's what this really is. It's not about socialism. It's about you know, capitalism for them. They can have all the money, and it's going to be socialism for us. We get to share the crumbs. And I'm not having it. I don't know about you guys, but you know, let me know what you guys think about this kind of crap. I mean, it's just, it's unbelievable. I am not saying I'm a climate change denier. I'm just saying I don't know if what they're saying is actually the reason, because they lie all the time. So let me know what you guys think in the comment section. Please don't forget to like and subscribe. Uh, thanks so much, very much for watching the video, guys. And I'll be back shortly with a new one.